Amanda Thomas, Kelly Buckheister, for a two-week study abroad program in summer 2025 to Finland. There we will focus on sustainability and outdoor education. Renowned for its educational system, pristine landscapes, and commitment to environmental conservation, Finland seamlessly integrates sustainability into everyday life, schooling, and informal education. Did you know that Finland aims to be carbon neutral by 2035? And that about 75% of the country is covered with forests, which is an area larger than the UK, Italy, or the state of Nebraska. Or that the Finns enjoy a fundamental legal right called everyman's rights. This allows anyone in Finland the freedom to roam, forage for mushrooms and berries, fish, and enjoy recreational use of all natural areas, public and private. After arriving in the capital city of Helsinki, we'll take the overnight Santa Claus Express train to the <laughs> northern city of Rovaniemi. There we will explore summer activities in Lapland, such as hiking in a national park and visiting museums focused on Arctic nature, culture, and history. You'll also have a chance to try out the Finnish tradition of ice swimming, where you go back and forth between a hot sauna and then plunge into an icy cold pool. Did you know that Finland has more saunas than cars? And that sauna is the only Finnish word that we've adopted in common English? Sorry if you're hoping to see the Northern Lights. We'll be there at the wrong time of year to catch the Aurora, but you can see a glimpse of the midnight sun if you stay up late enough. Oh, and we'll probably see some reindeer along the way too. Once back in Helsinki, we will learn more about sustainability and outdoor education through a combination of visits to cultural sites and museums, lectures and interactions with local experts, and reading discussions with UNL faculty. Us. Did you know that Helsinki is an archipelago with over 300 islands in the city limits alone? We're gonna visit at least two of them. And as you may have heard, Finland was named the happiest country in the world for the past seven years. But did you know that they're also the number one European country for heavy metal bands per capita? We'll also take a ferry across the Gulf of Finland for a day trip to Tallinn, Estonia. There, we will visit an outdoor open air museum and the 13th century Old Town, which may make you feel like you're stepping back in time into a medieval fairy tale. This will also be our second visit to UNESCO World Heritage Center, the first being Suomenlinna Island in Helsinki. Tallinn is known as the Silicon Valley of the Baltic for their innovation and entrepreneurship in the tech sector. You probably heard of Skype, which is co-founded by an Estonian. Another fun fact, Tallinn was named the European Green Capital for 2023 because of their biodiversity, sustainability-focused governance, and green innovation. Estonia also has one of the world's best education systems, ranking first among European countries. They emphasize student-centered, experiential learning, teacher autonomy and professionalism, and they center equity within their educational system. We do hope you'll consider joining us for this unique and exciting experience in Finland. Kitos! That's finished for thank you. And with that, we're finished. Get it? Finished? finished.